What's going on, YouTube? Today we're going to be shooting the Benjamin Marauder 22 pistol. I picked it up on Pyramid Air. I was looking at it for a bit. I picked it up on Pyramid Air uh, for 330 bucks. I gave him the 10 for 10. Um, I got it on the uh, on the uh, sale for uh, St. Patty's. You're uh, looking at my uh, my test cart. Uh, basically, uh, there's the Rex P50. Uh, underneath it is the Discovery 22. You got the Benjamin Bulldog 357 there. You got more 357. Uh, another Rex P50 underneath there. Um, another Rex P50 here. And today, I actually did take a few shots with this. I, I honestly have to invest in a in a um, a GoPro because I I cannot do videos as good as some of these other guys. Um, my videos are real. They're just me. Um, I hold my phone. I'm shooting my gun single-handed. I'm that good of a shot. Um, but I could show you. Uh, I did do a shot prior, and of course I didn't stitch them together. Um, but I hit that, and I hit the bottle a few times, and that's where I'm shooting from. I'm shooting from the A&M clock tower. That's about 50 yards, I would think. Um, we could check that out. Um, so, yeah, uh, that's the distance. I'm using a Monstrum 1.3 scope. I love it. Uh, it was under 100 bucks. Um, <laughs> it's dead accurate. I mean, it took me maybe... 10 15 minutes to zero it i did laser sight at first um zeroed it and then uh, away it went i'm shooting um the ruger 22 17 grain the gun loves it um i did get like one or two flyers in the first few shots of the gun the first eight string but she settled down uh after the next eight um so this is going to be the third string i put through the gun so you're seeing it fresh virgin uh, apparently you know the barrels uh people have um hit or miss i got a hit so let's go take a look do some shots and uh see what we get okay so here's our vantage point here i'm gonna bring the zoom up uh, but i don't want to mess with these foam buttons because it's a real pain in the neck and i'll lose the video as i did the last 10 times um so what i'm going to do is i'm going to pause bring the zoom up and uh i'll show you the uh the next shots we're going for the bottle I gotta wait for traffic here. I could see all my traffic. I got a little bit of traffic. So we're just gonna hold out. I could see both sides of the road, down the road, and it looks like we're gonna be clear now. So we're going for the bottle first. And there she is. Now we're gonna go for the bottle cap. And you can't see it in the video. It's that little red dot, but I gotta wait for the traffic here. Two shots, two hits at that range. The Monstrum is probably one of the best scopes for a small pistol that I've used. That's how she looks. Um, it's just a great little scope. I'm at 3x power now. Um, maybe, maybe, maybe you could see through it. I don't know. Let's find out. Let's see what you're looking at. Do you want to see it with the reticle lit? Let's lit, light the reticle for you. So here's, it's a fixed reticle, um, but it's designed so you don't have to worry about battery. So if it does die, uh, it's got a little bit of issues with the, uh, with the lighting around the side, but damn it, if I could get that for you, let's see if I can put it on a white surface. Yeah, unfortunately, this is going to be pretty tough to get you a view. Um, you guys could go online, check it out, but uh, highly recommended. So you see it, two shots, um, Marauder at that distance, uh, two hits easily, one-handed. Um, I guess I got a good barrel.